Hey guys, I am in the OR and I am about to remove a large 10 centimeter um, ovarian cyst for patients. Now, many patients have uh, ovarian cysts, many of you have ovarian cysts, many women get ovarian cysts over time, and one of the questions is, well, do I take it out? How do I know if, sh if I should take it out? These cysts can be anywhere from one centimeter to 10, 20, 25. They can get really large. But how do you know when you should take it out? So let me go over the top three things that I um, kind of use as a guide to help my patients figure this out. So number one, is it bothering you? And this is an interesting one because for some patients, a cyst that is four centimeters can be really painful. Um, and for other patients, they've got a 10, 15 centimeter cyst and they didn't even know they had one. I know it's hard to believe, but you know, it's been there for a long time. It's been slowly growing and they don't ever realize that, you know, they have it. So, uh, so number one, is it really bothering you? Number two, what is the size um, of the cyst? And I, this, is, this is something to pay attention to because there's a particular size at which time the cyst is more likely to twist or torse. Now I made a whole separate video on ovarian torsion and how that can be extremely painful and you can actually lose blood supply to the ovary and you know potentially even need the ovary out. So between about four to six centimeters is when that ovary can twist on itself and lose blood supply to the ovary. Um, These really small cysts typically don't twist and really large cysts don't twist because they are very heavy and they don't really, you know, they don't really um, have that uh, momentum to, to be twisting. So the size of the, the cyst and the risk of torsion is something to consider. So that's number two. And number three, could it actually be cancerous? I know when people have ovarian cysts, that's one of the top things in their mind. Oh my goodness, can this be ovarian cancer? So there's a lot of information that goes into determining this. So your age, your family history, what does a cyst look like on ultrasound, on MRI? Maybe your doctor will do some blood work, you know, put all this information together and then decide, okay, you know what, you probably should get this out versus eh, it looks okay, we can, we can monitor it. So these are the top three things to consider when thinking about whether you should have your ovarian cyst removed. So number one, is it bothering you? Number two, what is the size and is it likely to torse or twist on itself causing ovarian torsion? And number three, could this be cancerous? So uh, think about these things. If you have an ovarian cyst, talk to your gynecologist. If you are in the Bay Area and you're looking for an awesome gynecologist um, to help you decide whether you, this is something you need to remove or not, or if you know you want to remove your ovarian cyst and you're looking for um, an excellent GYN surgeon, please come and see me in my office. I'm in Lafayette. I'm putting down my information below, and I'll see you later. Bye.